hello everyone welcome to how to fix stack in this video guys you can see the error so if you are facing the same issue this video is for you i will show you step by step how to troubleshoot this issue guys so first of all we need to run the windows inbuilt troubleshooter that is very powerful and can fix any kind of issues related to audio so make a right click on the icon here right click and simply run troubleshoot sound problem and it will try to detect the issue automatically and will take some time and let's see if that fix the issue or not checking audio devices driver this is also scan the device driver audio driver as well as the windows services and if the problem is not a big it will instantly fix the issue So as you can see here the icon is showing here and seems my issue is fixed now Okay but it is still scanning as so let's wait here so i have to select this option apply this fix you have to select the same here and it is starting to restart your system so we have to select here next and try to resolving the issue here so pc must be restarted hardware change might be detected so that is fix the issue so you can restart your system guys and you don't need to follow the second step if you have still issue so you have to move on to the second method in the second method we need to go to the device manager here simply open the device manager and once you open the device manager see if you are able to see the audio input output and also sound video and game controller if you are not able to see that click on your computer name and then click on view and show hidden devices and also you can run scan hardware changes now if you are able to see the video audio and game controller here like this you have to right click the main driver that is real tech in my case in your case it could be different but that is you need to right click update simply choose this option then this option and from here choose the latest one high definition audio device and select next here select yes and it is going to install the latest driver and it is asking to restart the system guys as you can see here so you need to restart your system after that and it will fix the issue on also check if any yellow explanation mark on it so you have to uninstall that in case the audio driver and you have to restart the system guys and after that window will automatically load the correct driver for you if the window is not able to load the correct driver for you that we have another way to fix that we have to open the system devices here and once you open the system devices you need to look for carefully here and look for audio related driver here we need to right click there update it and simply follow the system okay simply hit next option here and then it will be started and the audio driver will be installed here and your issue will be fixed here after applying these methods and also you need to make sure that your window is up to date guys sometime if window is not updated in windows 11 especially so there could be the issue with your windows so make sure your window is up to date and check all the updates here and after that your issue will be fixed if three options or three steps are not working on your windows so let's move on to the final method and this is very powerful we have to install the manual driver so simply open the google chrome or whichever browser you use and type the dell driver whichever laptop or the system you are using if you are using the lenovo or hp lenovo driver simply tap there and hp drivers simply 
and we need to find the serial number in our laptop or system I am using here the laptop so I am showing you the example of the serial number serial number should be listed like this you can see here here is the serial number and you can manually enter here but if you are not able to find the serial number with this so we have command prompt for you simply open the CMD as admin or normally type the W M I C space BIOS space get and then serial number together and hit enter serial number will be copy so select it and press C on your keyboard control C paste it here simply click on search okay once you have searched it it will find out the correct driver and exact driver for your windows and you can also open the system information here you can see here system model number system manufacturer here and you need to download here the manufacturer and recommended driver here in my case it is Realtek high definition audio so I need to click on download option here and once you have clicked on, on the download option it will be downloaded and after that let me show you how to run the driver simply go to the so this is the driver I have downloaded that you have to double click on the driver running its exe is very easy you have to just click on installed let me try here once you have to wait here guys once you have double click on it it will take some time to load you can see here the window should look like this so you have to click on next here then you need to click on next and it is installing the driver the same way if you have the another another manufacturer or even if you have the different driver you have to follow the same steps Just double click on it it may again ask you to restart your system twice so you have to do that and I'm pretty sure guys after applying these four methods your issue should fix now you have to select yes I want to restart my computer and after that guys your issue will be fixed so I'm pretty sure guys after applying these method your issue will be fixed so if your issue is fixed then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech